Hey guys, Barry here and welcome to the official first look at Discovery for the Nintendo Switch. Now as always a massive thank you to Jokum as well from Nowanda and yeah I'm very excited about this. I was pushing for ages for this game to come on Switch because it's a great game I think. But uh, let's get info here. So if you don't know the Wii U version of Incorrect was 2.0 was a 1 or something? I can't remember exact, but this is 2.5 now, as you can see. Options here, same as before. You can change the uh, bloom there. Shadows, on and off. Sunbeams. So I, I love the fact that you actually have the options to, you know, control what you have in the game. Fog there as well, as you can see. And Auto Fade HUD. Which I do recommend you put on. Well, if you're used to the game, I guess. But, uh, audio here. You can turn it down. You know. And controls is here, okay? As normal. Pretty simple. You can, you know, change this a bit as well. Okay, so there is actually new pieces in this game you can do. New items, you know, new materials. We can create a world here. So we can pick flat, you know, we can pick what we want, where there's no trees or anything. Basic. Or right, let's do extended. Okay, let's go for uh, extended, you know. Animals, uh, static there as well, or... Yeah, let's put animals on. Now I actually had a go earlier on, and you know, in handheld mode, and it's uh, pretty amazing, I must say. So yeah, so what's new here is the new animation. If you can see there, the blocking up and down, you know that wobble effect. Sorry, I'm too loud, but uh, change it as normal. You can do this here. Press X to fly. Pretty cool. Like, for me, this game is just stunning. Now, I guess let's look at the new uh, materials here, will we? So, we've, this stuff is normal. Unlike the Wii version here as well. We do have the uh, the question block, you know, the retro stones there. And you can change the color too. That must be new, is it? Green slime? No, I don't think so. But, uh So we fire there. Do sparkle. So here we have our, you know, our paint buckets. You can change the colors there. I will show you very quickly. Now this is new as well. We have a stone sphere. And the update is coming soon. I don't know when, you know, the exact date for the uh, PlayStation version, you know, for, for PSVR. Guys, get this game on, you know, VR. If you have a PS4, play it in VR. It's just stunning. We have letters here in text, numbers there as well, and we also have a new laser gun, as you can see. Maybe I'll turn the... Uh and yeah, you can change the time of day if you don't know. We're using the, uh, the plus and minus button. Start and select. So, looking at this direction, you can't even shoot, you know. What 
does it say? Two two zero zero. Yeah, has a pretty cool. What planet is that? Is that Jupiter or something? Yeah, so even though, like, you can't actually destroy anons with this. See there? Doesn't work. But, uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah, so that's, that's, that's uh, yeah, so use the D-pad to change the block. And press, you know, ZR to place it down, or ZL to destroy it. And now you, to change the block there, go on to... Here, for example, and press Y, and then we'll pick something else. So let's go for a paint bucket. Let's go for uh, pink or something. We can. Let's. I'll change the uh, sky there. See there. Pretty cool. And the grass change too. So if I cut the uh, HUD off or on auto fit HUD, yeah, okay. So l let's not do anything. To, uh, just, you know, fades away, it's pretty cool. And you can still, you know, do stuff in the game. But when you start to shoot something, you know, or do whatever, it comes back. Let's see what else is there. I guess this week, hopefully this week, I will do a multiplayer video, split screen. It's actually the first time we've had that in the game. And let's see what else is there. We can spawn sheep here. There we go. <laughs> let's see, fire here. Oh yeah, the... Uh That's pretty cool. Maybe I'll turn the uh, the bloom down. Turn this off as well. I guess there's a bit of you know change in performance when you do that. Not that, not that that's anything wrong. I just think it's fine. Let's go for the uh, the sphere. Excuse me. Yes, yeah, so we have white sphere. We can change the color of that there as well. Yeah, that's it, really, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this again. Massive thank you to Jokum as well from uh, Nuwanda for giving us exclusive early hands on. And this game is coming to America this week. Is it $8? I can't think of the exact price, sorry. And it's coming to Europe next week. It's also coming to Japan this week, and it does have Japanese and English. And the American version, I'm guessing European, has French, Italian, German, Spanish, Portuguese too. So. Alright guys, you can of course check us out on YouTube, Twitter and Instagram. And for more Nintendo and Discovery, keep it right here. Thanks for watching. And as always guys... Stay fresh.